Hello everyone, it's Rory here at that Eurovision site and I'm joined by the amazing Elsha who will be hoping to represent Ireland with Gutobin. Uh, King Queer will too. Uh, oh my god, what does that mean? <laughs> This is what Gutobin's about, just losing your Irish over the years. That's it. Well, I went to say Giagwitch, really. Giagwitch, yeah. Giagwitch. Yes, Margaret. Yeah, could it's a tall too. Oh, <laughs> oh my god, we know exactly what we're doing here, guys. Exactly. Like, it's chaos. And I, love it. I love it, it's amazing. So how has it been sort of having this entire stage, you know, like come alive with what your stage concept is going to be like? We're very excited about what we're doing for this. You know, we, I wrote the song specifically with the Eurovision stage in mind, mm -hmm. but what we've been able to create for this is definitely, I think it will give everyone a taster of what we could do if the song were to get through to Malmo. Okay. So we're, we're looking forward. To right, this. okay. Yeah. So if you had to describe sort of what you were planning in three words, what would it be? Kegs. Okay. Pearls. Toilets. Toilets? Mmm, mm, okay. I'm intrigued. Well, I mean, there we go. Okay, so there's a very clear idea in that. I like the sound of that. Yeah. And of course, obviously, you know, we're like, you've, you've spoken about how much, you know, the, the importance of the Irish languages. I mean, have you noticed that there's been an uptake in people like supporting you and like sort of willing you to sort of like sing in Irish at Eurovision? Yes, definitely. I mean, it's it's gone beyond, you know, a, a, the response in Ireland itself was fantastic, but people all over the world are now able to count to eight and Irish, you know, <laughs> people all over the world are going oct and it's it's just been incredible to just see that it's gotten this kind of response. Yeah, and it definitely, I mean, it's fantastic as well to sort of see national pride, I guess, in our language kind of come back again, because speaking as an Irish person myself, I mean, like, not a lot of people usually sort of speak the language, so it's nice to hear it sort of enter back into the mainstream, which is quite nice, actually, isn't exactly. it? Exactly, that's the thing, because like I, I grew up learning conver or learning Irish in a conversational way, yeah. and I love the language. I did get a fáinne. I used to be very good oh, really? at Irish, but it's just now, it's like it's gradually gone. I just thought there's a whole song in that. Um, so yeah, I just I just hope that people, like, all, all be it chaos, you know, on the stage and a lot of fun. I hope people, it lures people in to learn the message about the Irish language. Definitely, fantastic. Well, thank you so much as well. All more and the best of luck. I can't wait to see how it's going to play out. So thank you so much. Thank anyway, you so thank much. you.